I'm Jasmine Howe for Couture, and today we're speaking with the beautiful and incredibly talented Megan Park on location ahead of her vamp show. Today I'm thrilled to be here with the very talented Megan Park. Megan, thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule to show us around. Pleasure. Pleasure. Now, thank you're you. involved in VAMP again this year. We know yeah. you've been around involved in VAMP for a couple of years yeah. now. What are we doing this year? What's, what, what, what can we keep an eye out for? Okay, yeah, well it's good to be part of the InStyle show um, this coming season. Um, so it's for it's the presentation of our winter collection winter? essentially. Yeah. yeah. So there's a lot of there's a lot of bright sort of jewel tones with mixed uh, florals, like very botanical florals, um, back with quite sort of um, optical kind of um, colourful geometrics of sort of acid greens and fabulous. Um, so we're gonna pinks, see some yeah. colour coming through a winter. A lot of colour actually. Well it's, it's offset with, with black, of course. Um, Melbourne's favourite colour. Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> but we're probably one of the more colourful collections um, during the winter season. I think, is it important to kind of build in all of those different elements of a wardrobe, of a lifestyle to really kind of convey? Well, I think, um, I mean, the great thing about VAMP is that it really connects with our audience here in Melbourne and yeah. our customers. And so it's great to, um, when they come into our boutiques, it's very much the world of Megan Park, so we showcase everything. So, but the VAMP's runway is really about our ready-to-wear collection, of course, accessorised. Well, you are known for yeah. your embroidery and that really strong attention to detail. Yeah. I mean, this is just an exquisite piece. How long would something like this actually take from well, this inception? Is, okay, so this is unusual because it is actually the only one piece of um, machine embroidered piece um, embroidery in our collection. We're really known for hand, hand embroidery. Yeah. So, um, however, you've chosen the one <laughs> piece that's not by hand. Um, but for example, you know, any a piece could take anywhere. I mean, this one here is totally hand embroidered. So, something like this could take maybe three days of embroidery. Yeah. yeah. So that's all done on organza, and then it's been hand cut out, and then hand applique onto the silk crate. So, so very much that hand yeah, touch. I mean, Something might take a day, something might take 10 days. It really depends on the piece.